YouTube, YouTube channel. channel. My name is Asmi. I'm Roger. And today's topic we'll be talking about how much is the rental if you stayed in the Philippines. Correct. And uh, our previous vlog is all about uh, buying land or farmer wants to buy land here in the Philippines. It is expensive so you can watch that video. So now for today's uh, subject is all about um, renting. renting an apartment and this would be a lot you know we can see foreign people ask uh, how much is the rental how much is the rental and how much is the rental and how much is the rental and how much is the rental so again it depends on the location where you're at yes well it really depends on the location or like if you're if you want to live in um, like Cebu or Manila or like big cities for sure the the amount um, from a small like it's only a studio room or master room if you're like in a ho hotel yeah in a hotel um that costs like about four thousand five hundred or three thousand five hundred a month and that's only a studio room right but uh, yeah if you're if you are in big cities if you want to live in an apartment like having two rooms that's roughly um ten thousand pesos or, or above 50. yes yes if you want to have that space and if you want to have that kitchen that comfort room that you want like if you really want to have that apartment type but if you're okay with just a, a master room like um you can just sleep put your clothes there yeah three thousand five hundred roughly roughly that's the cheapest 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 one yeah the cheapest one i guess if you're living in a city but if you are in the province area it's i think it's really cheap right yes like here in, in our place in san carlos which we're living in a small town um actually we're just renting an apartment right now and it costs like eight thousand five hundred peso and that's equivalent to like about 169 to 170 dollars per month and yes. which is huge because uh, we have like a uh, dining room we have two rooms already and we have a stack room and we have a garage as well so uh, it's very like, affordable if you have that you know um, let's say for example uh, if you're going to compare in a big city yes if you would compare this to a big city specifically in Cebu this apartment already costs like ten thousand above yes ten not, or not more. including the electricity right yes so we're just talking about the rental expenses if how much and yeah it, it really depends on uh your choice if you like we said earlier if you want to live in a small town or a large town yes so in my experience we in our experience we actually tried renting an apartment or no not an apartment but a room in cebu because yeah we used to live in cebu city yeah before. we we used to live in cebu before so uh we need to have a, a rental space that is near to our work our so, office yeah our, our company so we found a very very convenient space which is really close to uh, our company. It's like which is an IT park. If yeah. you um, are been familiar to, with IT park, yeah. If you've been to Cebu, IT park is really, really popular for tourists. Um, so a lot of a lot of actually workers are call centers there. So we're we're one of those call centers before. We used to live. Uh, in a rental space near IT Park and the area is called Apas. Um, when it comes to the distance between our company to that rental space, it would take like three to five minutes walking, which is really convenient for us. But yeah, the space, the rental space is so small. There is just an area 
that you could sleep and the closet is there there's no kitchen there's no no bathroom comfort room and uh, and the payment was about three thousand five hundred without the electricity yet yes so very small um space but uh, we don't have um, a choice because uh, we really want to like leave, like stay close to our company if you um, like want to stay like far the the problem there is you will encounter like um, traffic jam so but in a nutshell um, if you yeah uh, wish to uh, leave like place which is uh, when you within your budget so much better for you to to like look for a city which is not that uh, big and yeah you can you can find a, a place or a good place to stay which is like 180 or like 170 dollars per month for a good place to stay like us yes so we actually choose this apartment because Aside from it's uh, it's safe um, for us, it's a little bit silent compared to the other the other locations that we rented. It was so noisy. There was a coffee area. The other one has like neighbors were always playing loud music. Yes, and but a lot it, of dogs. A lot of dogs in this area. Yeah, there's chickens. Yes. You can hear a little bit of noise, but that's still okay. At least it, you can't see other people like um, talking so loudly. You can't hear them like uh, there's no like loud noises. So this area is pretty much uh, convenient for our work since we're already working in as a home base, right? Yeah. Yes, correct. And I think. That's pretty much about it, and all you need to do, and it's like you know how to to budget. If you are in a tight budget, so or if you have like a small salary every month, so much better for you to to find a place which is just suit on your budget. Yeah, um, find a place that is not too far. If you prefer to be in the city, of course, that would really cost a lot. If you would prefer um, like within your budget range you should just go with the province area yeah province area because um, renting an apartment is um, affordable yes so uh, next topic would be we'll be talking about the cost of living here how much is the expenses for daily needs electricity and water yes Another thing, so yeah, we're just talking about renting an apartment and uh, expenses are not included yet and electricity are not included so it really depends on how you use it. So but yeah, this is just like um, a key or um, an, idea. an idea where you want or like you can save money. Okay, so again thank you so much for supporting our videos please like share and comment if you have other topics for us to make um don't forget to subscribe yes. hit the bell icon and thank you so much guys thank you so much for watching bye, -bye.